everybody. Hello there. It's Aisha the Artsy Grandma. Hope you're all well. Happy 2021 to everybody. Happy New Year. I've got some really good news to share with you. Um, my son and my daughter-in-law got engaged um, early December. And then I thought they were going to um, get married next year, but they decided no, they weren't going to wait. Things aren't going to change because of the pandemic. Um, they had a very um, intimate little wedding, um, an Islamic wedding, um, on the 25th of December. And um, yeah, it was just my immediate family and um, my daughter-in-law's immediate family. Um, and that's it. So... Yep, they've um, got their own flat and they've moved in together, so, and can you believe it, my daughter-in-law's called Aisha as well, so we've got two Aisha armies in the family now, yay! Anyway, so that was my uh, little bit of good news I wanted to share with you, so obviously I had to stop filming towards the end of December, mid-December and sort of try and get things ready plan the um, meal and you know, the little get-together that we had. Of course, adhering to strict rules, there were only 15 people at the wedding, so... Yep, that's it. All my children are married now. Just uh, me and Artsy Grandad at home now, and it's so quiet without him. Because he's in and out all day, in and out all day it's uh it's yeah it's really quiet so what have i been working on i thought um i wanted to make a, a surprise gift for somebody so i've been working on this canvas I, i've put the names on the top so i've hidden them but can you see i've used silver leaf stuck it onto the canvas oh by the way i had henna on my hands and it's all come off now can you see for the wedding we put henna on and had it on my nails and all the colours come off now so yay um I'm gonna just show you my other hand as well. Can you see there? It's all coming off now so the it'll fade off my nail as well very quickly. It'll just grow out. Um so yeah I have I've had a quite a busy week um all oh, these past uh, two three weeks and now Every, all the children were here yesterday evening for the New Year's Eve. We saw the New Year in together and it's really quiet today. So I thought, well, first chance I've had to really do, you know, a chance to sit down and do some filming. So I wanted to share my good news with you all. I'll tell you what I've been working on. So I made this canvas. Um, the couple who I'm making it for, they've got four children. So I'm going to... Put the names on here in these on those four leaves at the side and you could say it's uh, rather like a tree of life you know just like, let me just uh, see if i can zoom in a little bit and you can see all the uh, a lot of detail has gone into it and you can see the um silver leaf that i put on there as well it's the first time i've actually used it um Rather, uh, I thought it might have been quite difficult to use. So I put a little bit of silver leaf down here on the leaves as well. And then down here on this side. If I can let me just pull you back out again. On here on the leaves. And there's a little bit of metallic paint. Um, down here and here. There's like some dots which I'm going to have to... I think I must have pressed, pressed them. You know, you do... And that's got spoiled too, so I'll have to sort that out. But yeah, so I've been working on this uh, canvas for the past couple of weeks. And it's nearly finished now, so I thought, well, before I put the names on, I'll just show it to you to see what I've made. And just uh, wrap the foot, and there's some leaves at the bottom and some flowers that have fallen off the tree. So everybody, I hope you've all had a lovely time over the uh, 
holiday period to all my Christian friends who have um, celebrated Christmas. I hope you've had a lovely Christmas. And to everybody, um, wishing you all a happy 2021. And let's hope we have a, you know, a happy and prosperous and a better 2021. Let us um, look after one another and especially our loved ones and those people who are alone. Let's see if we can visit them, even if it's just a doorstep visit. Makes a big difference, doesn't it? I know at the local mosque, um, just before um, the children broke off for Christmas from school, they did food parcels, and I think, because um, my husband, Artsy Grandad, he's a volunteer as well, and he's on the committee, on the mosque committee. Um, he was helping out, and I think um, just before the uh, children broke up, there was about five, six volunteers and the whole host of the ladies who went down to help. They did 250 food parcels containing about 50 different items, I think it was, or, you know, not far off anyway. So all the children were really pleased and very happy that they'd received something. And you know, they got lots of them. Um, and they did it in conjunction with the, um, the local church, St. Stephen's Church. And can you believe... The, the vicar at the church, he speaks Urdu. He spent some time out in Pakistan, um, in Karachi actually, so he'd learnt Urdu. So, yeah, you know, he talks Urdu and I thought that was absolutely fantastic. So in conjunction with the church, St Stephen's Church and our um, local mosque, which is uh, the called, called the Masjid of Salaheen, they uh, distributed... Um, 250 food parcels to all the children um, in, in the school. So I thought that was a lovely gesture to the community. Um, and all the children were really happy. And they got a lot of um, messages of thank you very much, you know, from from the mothers and you know, from the parents who had received the gifts. Um, so, you know, when, when, when the church and the mosque work together, they can do great things. I think it's absolutely wonderful how you can do that. When two communities can come together and the good that they can do. I think I'm becoming really emotional now, so I'm going to finish this video now. So I just wanted to show you this canvas that I'm just about to complete because I'm going to put the names on now. So let me see if I can just bring it out a little bit and then you can see. There you go. I'll say bye-bye for now. Bye-bye. And I'll see you all again very soon. Watch this space. Record, recording for the Artsy Grandma will resume very soon. Bye-bye. Bye-bye for now.